portions of it in the hills 90 miles north of San Francisco on the west coast of the United States. We see evidence of it on the island of Hawaii, in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. And we see evidence of it at Yellowstone National Park, in the middle of the North American continent. What do we know about these places? And what do they tell us about our Earth? Well, for one thing, they tell us there's a lot of heat down there somewhere. The great steaming vents and geysers at Yellowstone Park are spread through an area 60 miles wide and 60 miles long. Some seem to erupt any time they feel like it. And some, like Old Faithful, erupt on schedule. There are boiling mud holes called mud pots. And there are steaming vents called fumaroles, which just seem to go on forever. Now, what causes all of this spurting and bubbling? Well, geologists will tell you that this was once a very active volcanic area. A major volcanic explosion happened here about 600,000 years ago. A few miles below the surface, there's a chamber of hot molten material, or magma, right here under our feet. These spectacular geysers are caused by groundwater percolating down near the hot molten material. Water from rain or snow has seeped down through passages in the rock. is being heated by the very hot layers of rock down near the magma chamber. However, the weight of the water above has increased the pressure on the water below. This raises the boiling point of the heated water. It becomes superheated, much hotter than its normal boiling temperature. Now, the superheated water starts to move up to 